Hi, I'm Thomas Hedström, uh, amateur videographer. I'm participating in One Day on Earth from the capital of Sweden, Stockholm, and the northbound archipelago over to Finland. I'm going to document the heavy ferry traffic between Stockholm and Finland. Stockholm, the capital of Sweden, is located on the east coast of Sweden, where Lake Mälaren meets the Baltic Sea. Stockholm is known for its beauty, its architecture and buildings, its very clean and beautiful open water and its many parks. About one third of the city area is made up of waterways and another one third is made up of parks and green spaces. Two harbours in central Stockholm are hosting the ferry traffic to Finland and Estonia. Over 10 million ferry passengers are passing through the ports of Stockholm in one year. The central parts of Stockholm are built on 14 islands and are continuous with the Stockholm archipelago. The Stockholm archipelago consists of around 24,000 islands and islets and extends from Stockholm roughly 60 kilometers to the east and follows the coastline. The ferry traffic to Finland and Estonia passes through the archipelago every day. Today, on 10 10 10, the first ferries are reaching the outer parts of the archipelago around 5 o'clock in the morning and have a four hour journey in the archipelago before reaching Stockholm. After one hour, they have reached the inner, more narrow parts of the archipelago and passes through the sun. There are 14 ferries traveling through the Stockholm archipelago for about four hours before reaching the Stockholm harbor and later back again within the 24 hour period. Each ferry carry up to 2,800 passengers and 480 cars. Halfway into Stockholm, the inbound ferries meets the ferries that left Stockholm this morning. While the ferries passes through the archipelago, they constantly move around three to four thousand cubic meters of water. The ferry finally reaches Stockholm and will stay in harbour for about two hours before leaving again. In the late afternoon and early evening, the last ferries prepares to leave the Stockholm Harbour.
They will now be cruising through the archipelago. The restaurant, bars, discotheques and casinos start their business, as well as the tax-free shops. Today on 101010 10, there was about 28 passages during the 24-hour period. This goes on every day, 365 days a year. This obviously do have an impact on the sensitive environment.